Yo, 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 guys, it's your boy Mohammed back again with another video. Today, I'm by myself, no collabs, nothing. Unfortunately, I ain't got enough friends to do collabs with and stuff. But anyway, I'm coming back with another reaction video today. And today's actually gonna be a special one because this one, this one, this one is deep in my heart. Like, this topic, I can get religious about this topic, I'm not gonna lie. What we're gonna be reacting to today is how deep is the ocean? Now, I'm not gonna lie, me. I'm scared of the water, I'm scared of the sea, the ocean, it's the same thing. I'm scared of all of that because of one thing that happened maybe like three, four years ago. Let me tell you guys a quick story, all right? So I wasn't always scared of the sea. This whole time I thought I can swim, I'm not gonna lie. In primary school, I used to be a swimmer, I'm not gonna lie. And about three, four, or even five years ago, I don't know how long ago it was, me and a few friends, we went to a swimming pool inside the gym. And we all got ready and Bear in mind, I haven't swam for, I don't know how long, like three years, probably even longer than now. I probably haven't swam for about six years before that. So here I am getting ready, I've got my trunks on, everything, whatever you call them. And I see two of my fat friends. They're both fat, now I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna call out no one's names or anything, but they're both fat. They probably know who they are watching this video right now. I see them both dive in the water like, like Michael Phelps or something. So I'm like, what? I'm like, what the hell is going on? Hold on. So I go, I'm running. And I try dive in the water as well. And as soon as I dive, I sink right to the bottom. Bear in mind, this pool is probably like 10 meters flipping high or something. Cause me, me, I'm six foot eight, so. Stop the cap. But anyway, as soon as I dive in the water, I start drowning. So I was like, what the hell is going on? How are my fat friends jumping in the water? I'm floating perfectly without doing anything. And I'm sitting there in the water drowning. And the whole time I'm just holding on to the side. So after that experience, me and the ocean, me and swimming, we just parted ways. And from now on, I hate everything to do with the water and then drinking water because who doesn't like drinking water? But anyway, let's just get into the video. By the way, if you guys want to see any type of videos, whatever you guys want to see, just comment it down below because I've already run out of video ideas. And if you guys don't give me anything, then it looks like I'm going to retire early. Um, before we start the video, you guys go check out my clothing line that's coming soon. It's going to be in the description below. I've got a quick newsletter or something you guys can sign up to for, to get 10% off your first order on release. So sign up to that newsletter, get your 10% off. You guys don't want to miss it, I'm telling you. So yeah, do that. And you guys already know, draw, like, comment, share, subscribe, and let's get into the video. Deep does the ocean go? If you took the highest point on land and submerged it, you would still have more than a mile between you and the deepest point in the oceans. The oceans harbor 99% of all- So already they're kicking off with some dangerous facts. If you take the highest point in the world, which is, I don't know what mountain it is, it's probably Mount Everest. Don't, don't call me stupid or anything, but I think it's Mount Everest. I think if you take Mount Everest, you put it in the water, they're still going to be ball living space on Earth and have enough water to fill a bathtub that's 685 miles long on each side. For scale, here's a human and here's a blue whale, the largest animal on Earth. You see, first of all, if I'm ever stuck in the water just like that, like sitting in the middle of nothing, just like that. I would rather die than to be in that situation, I'm not going to lie to you. Second of all, if I see a well that looks like that underneath me, I don't, I would probably just pass out in the water, I'm not going to lie. No, there's no way I'll ever see a well or whatever that is underneath me. Blue whales usually hunt at depths of around 330 no, feet so within the well-lit zone of the ocean. Deeper down, at 700 feet, the USS Triton became the first submarine to circumnavigate the Earth in 1960. At 831 feet, we that reached so, the deepest so free dive in recorded history. Down here, the pressure is 26 times greater than at the surface, which would crush most human lungs. But whales manage it, diving to a. How, how did he dive that far down if it crushes human lungs? Why do you see him? Nah, man. Max depth of 1,640 feet where they hunt giant squid. At 2,400 feet, we reach the danger zone for modern nuclear attack submarines. Any deeper, and the submarine's hull would implode. 
2,722 feet down is where the tip of the world's tallest building, the Burj Khalifa, would reach. Oh, that's a tall building. See, that's why I'm trying to live it up. I'm trying to live up in Dubai right there. I think that's in Dubai, by the way, but anyway. But let's get back to the to the giant squids. Why are there squids that big in the water? Like, what makes that? How, how does that even happen? A little farther, oh, at 3,280 feet, we're deep enough that sunlight can't reach us. We've now entered the midnight zone. Many animals down here can't... midnight zone so i tell me the sun if the sun can't reach you then that's you that's how you know you shouldn't be there because i'm pretty sure the sun is flipping the sun is everyone needs the sun to live and you're telling me the sun can't reach you that's how you know nothing should be down there can't see if anything lives like there, these eyeless know. shrimp at 7,500 feet who thrive near scalding hot underwater volcanoes at this depth Temperatures are just a few Those degrees above shrimp, freezing, but the something. waters around hydrothermal vents can heat up to 800 degrees Fahrenheit. 9,816 feet is the deepest any mammal has been recorded swimming. The Cuvier beaked whale. But not even the Cuvier beaked whale could explore the RMS Titanic, which rests at a staggering depth of 12,500 feet. Oh, that's a Titanic. The pressure is now 300... Gee, they made it down deep. I'm not gonna lie. That's crazy. I want to know how people get this information, like, if, if, if nothing can go down there, how do you even have this information in the first place? 78 times greater than at the surface. Yet, you can still find sea life, like the fangtooth, hagfish, and dumbo octopus, the deepest living octopus on that Earth. That looks like a Pokemon. At 20,000 feet is the Hadal Zone, an area designated for the ocean's deepest trenches, like the Mariana Trench. If you tipped Mount Everest into the Mariana the Trench, moment. its summit would reach down to 29,029 feet. That still doesn't compare to the two deepest crude missions in history. That name is the scariest name in the world, I'm not gonna lie. The Mariana Trench. That sounds like that sign you don't know about in there. From. In 2012, director James Cameron descended to 35,756 feet for the Deep Sea Challenger mission. But Cameron didn't quite break the record, which was set by oceanographer Jacques Picard and Lieutenant Don Walsh in 1960. Crazy. Picard and Walsh descended to the lowest point on Earth, Challenger Deep, at a record 35,797 feet I, below the surface. I don't, I don't care Since how then, much you pay me, if you pay me billions. Uh, billions, maybe I'll do it. But I don't, I don't know how much you're paying me to do something like this. But if there's a chance of me making it back alive with a few billion in my pocket, then I might do this. But other than that, I'll never ever touch the ocean in my life. Then scientists have sent half a dozen unmanned submersibles to explore Challenger Deep, including Kaiko, which collected over 350 species off the seafloor between 1995 and 2003. But scientists estimate there are potentially thousands of marine species we have yet to discover. Yes, there is. Humans have explored an estimated five to ten percent of Earth's oceans. So humans, us humans, have only discovered five to ten percent of what's inside the water. And if we go all the way to the start, where was it? Ninety-nine percent of all things on Earth are water. We pretty much don't know anything about Earth. And there's people here trying to make it to Mars and stuff like Elon Musk. You're a crazy man. But we don't know anything about Earth and you're trying to make it to Mars. So imagine what's down there. Imagine what's underneath us right now. There can be T-Rex fishes. There can be Megalodons. I, I know there's stuff we don't even know about in water right now. Underneath us that no one knows about. Even these, these vehicles here, whatever they are, they haven't picked up nothing like that. If you guys ever played a game called Ark Survival of Old, that's why I imagine, that's why I imagine um, the sea life to be, and that's why I'm just so scared of it, like, stuff like that. Those are aliens that shouldn't be on Earth, I'm not gonna lie. I might try to find some pictures, putting them up on the screen, of what I'm imagining in my head right now, but it's so scary, like. Me, water, nah, that can't happen. But anyway, like I said, there's so much in the ocean we haven't discovered and people like I don't I don't know how people are diving and stuff. That's that's just so scary to me. 
anyway if you guys enjoyed the video and you guys want to see me react to more videos i don't know anything um i can probably react to you some scary sea life animals anything like that just anything you want me to do anything you want to react to you then tell me down in the comment section below because right now i'm running out of ideas i'm not gonna lie got a whole list of ideas but i always i'm all, i don't know what to upload from it i'm not gonna lie so yeah if you guys enjoyed like comment share subscribe uh go follow the page in my description as well and i'll catch you guys on the next video